Hello everyone, my name is Om Sagaso. This is Navigation Drawer 2017. In this video, I will talk about how to send data from a fragment to another fragment in Android. Okay, let's go to Android. Okay, assume that you have already your Navigation Drawer like this. And now I have my first fragment in the first uh, menu here. So I will add another fragment. Okay, just go to Java, right click and just and choose fragment here the first one so the second one is gallery so just call gallery here and uncheck this too okay so my purpose here in the first one the fragment camera i will add another button but before i do that i want to change from uh, frame layout to constraint layout so right click and convert to constraint layout here I can do that because now I use Android Studio uh, 2.3.1 yes so I can use the constraint layout now I delete this one I add a button here okay so just click on this uh, star to make the constraint now just type uh, this and OK the text here is okay as well okay so you want to click this button and go to the uh, another fragment and then you uh, can send the data as well okay so now you go to uh, camera fragment here so to get a button first you have to create the view here okay and then return the we view and now you can create a button is an okay okay and we dot find you by id okay and be an okay now you can click on that button set on click listener new control space okay so now let's uh, open another fragment first before we want to send the data the gallery uh, fragment and gallery fragment new gallery fragment okay and fragment manager and manager get fragment manager and manager here and begin transaction replace so i have the layout in the content main here yeah this is the, the layout that any uh, fragment will go to and i call it main layout and be careful you cannot use the uh, layout for the fragment in the constraint you have to create an inner uh, layout or under the constraint layout constraint layout cannot use for the fragment okay be careful about that if you use the constraint layout to, to get a fragment here you will see the blank page okay so this is the code if you want to see now the name is main layout so i can use all.id main layout and the gallery fragment and commit okay so let me open it okay click on the first one now click on the button and you go to the second one okay this is the second one the hello uh, blank fragment here so we want to send the data so it's very easy so what you have to do here is call gallery fragment and dot set arguments and the data type is bundle so what you have to do is create another bundle uh, variable so just create a bundle and bundle here new bundle okay so just put string now this is the string and you give the key so just data and just my name so the data is now my name so you can add any more data put string again you can put integer if you want to uh, maybe here name and this is my channel and my channel is just my name okay this is my name and this is my channel okay so now you can uh, send bundle right here okay it's fairly easy what you have to do just this and now in the gallery fragment there is only one method that you can use it's called 
get argument okay now this is the argument and the data type is bundle again and then before we can grab the data you have to check if if the bundle is not now okay in case you didn't send then it would have some error okay so just grab that so let's create a string here so name bundle dot get string and p is name and string channel bundle get string and channel okay So you can do anything with the data, so just use the toast here. And the first parameter of the toast in the fragment is get context. Just uh, call get context here. And now name, I will plus my name here. And channel, plus with a channel name. Okay, run it. Okay, click on the first one, click on the button. See that? This is the data that we sent from the first to the second one. Okay, that's it for this video. I hope you like it. Thank you for watching. If you think this video is very useful, share it to your friend and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you and I will see you in the next video.